All right, what is going on everybody? It is Tristan and today in this video what I got going on for you guys is we're going to discuss the I'm Imani or Jordan 4 which did drop yesterday. I was lucky to secure my personal size, a size 10. I'm going to be putting that straight to the feet. Overall, it was a great day yesterday. My dad got his personal size in the Chicago's. I got my personal size in the I'm Imani Airs. So yeah, you know, pretty much got what I wanted. And overall, Hype Labs had amazing success as well. We hit hundreds of pairs. I will show the success once pairs are on the way. You know, we're just kind of waiting uh, for Amamani Air right now and seeing those orders, uh, you know, 100% go through. But success seems to be really good and our orders are still sticking as of right now, which is great. So if you guys want botters that'll again hit more items for you, I can't really say how many yet, but you will see soon. It was so many pairs that we hit for people. So I'm very happy to see this. And again, you can go get in our wait list if you're interested in copying more pairs just like this one. The Chicago's, what free ACO for the Chicago's, I've organized that, so stay tuned for it. And yeah, that's pretty much all I need to say. So if you're interested uh, and you know, getting daily deals, also don't forget about the daily under market pairs we do and all of our other services. Go join our waitlist here. And if you have any questions about it, let me know. But that's everything I really need to mention. Again, if you've been here, you probably know what this is. And we have a lot to offer. Feel free to ask people down below. We're legit with what we do. So that's everything. And uh, yeah, let's just kind of get started here. You can go follow us also. But getting into discussing this release, it was loaded up on sneakers for the 23rd. You can see it's not there anymore uh it was on our instagram page let me see if i can show this uh yeah right here so it was on the instagram page with the 225 dollar retail uh and yes our orders did stick they did not get canceled so i'm very happy to see that uh, our orders have stayed as of right now and overall you know it just came down to whether botters were jigging or not the people that had like 30 orders 26 orders you know that were posted on Am Am Amanier's page right here those are people that i'm assuming forgot to use proxies forgot to jig something like that because uh, I, I don't think they would be able to see how many times you've ordered right from one location, especially if you're using proxies for a bunch of, you know, different accounts. And uh, those are all for, you know, different locations for different people. I think this comment was pretty funny too. A lot of people are talking about, you know, backdoor stuff like that. I really do think it was dope though that a lot of manual users hit. That was a really good thing. I was able to hit as a manual user. I didn't think I had a chance with like, I had eight minutes in the queue. I personally always try and get five minutes and under, but I had like eight minutes left and I wasn't using really any sort of autofill or anything. So I'm pretty happy to see that I actually did uh, check out on a pair, but I got pretty lucky overall because I think some people like right behind me didn't get a size 10 and size 11 sold out like right before I got in uh, to the checkout page. And I also had like a couple errors when checking out. So I did get lucky overall with hitting my pair. If it gets canceled, that would suck. But uh, you know, overall it seemed like stock was pretty healthy for the online release. A lot of people thought that the video release was going to have more stock, but I just didn't see that being realistic because I didn't feel like so many people would submit a video. You know what I mean? A few thousand people did, but not, you know, as many people that went for the online release so they would make the online release uh you know higher stock but they're saying stay tuned for further updates and again i'm assuming with these orders right here that they'll cancel they'll run a you know a small little restock they did it for the ones don't forget they restocked those so yeah it overall was nice to see on my amount of year giving more manual users a chance especially after how confusing this release was at the start a lot the online release was a lot of people's only chance considering they didn't do in store which i'm still confused on that hopefully for their next i'm um, on here sneaker they do they will do in store because I just... I'm still like kind of confused on why they didn't do that. But again, I'm not here to ask questions. I, you know, understand that they were trying to, you know, kind of send out a message, but involving sneakers and politics together, it just is like, why do that? It's just, it's a shoe release, you know what I mean? But overall, great sneaker. I love how this one looks. I mean, I'm, I'm, this one, to say this, has 100% grown on me more. So I'm definitely gonna be wanting to wear this one when I get it in hand, I'm sure, you know, I'm gonna be making it in hand video, kind of giving you all a review. Prices are very high on this one right now. Don't forget also, if you go check the prices right now on StockX. A lot of people have been making some good bread pre-selling this. And don't forget in our Discord, if you hit a pair on these, you can pre-sell right now. Use our label scans we provide, other stuff like that. We have so many other services and there's people buying pairs right now. So you can make a quick little cash out, quick amount uh, off these sneakers since, you know, you paid like 250, 260, maybe some people 265 on the sneaker after you know shipping taxes all that so considering that i mean if you went and sold at stock x right now for 550 500 i mean you, that's some serious profit that's at least a couple hundred dollars right there just no problem so heavily recommend you know you get the pre-sales going try and sell this one in advance for like 400 plus uh before it lands and before the sneakers release on the 23rd since prices are definitely going to drop once that release happens that at 110 prices will drop i'm just going to say that so do not forget that fact prices will be going down 
when the sneakers release happens. I'm, I assume stock will probably be fairly decent too, probably over 20, 30,000. I'm hoping in the 40, 50,000 range, but again, we can't hope for too much. This is a nice sneaker, but it depends on how many they produced. Uh, pairs are already, you know, you can see still going for this super high amount, even with the online release. So I think a lot of people are waiting for, you know, pairs to land in hand before they, uh, you know, to go and sell it to apps. That's why the prices are as high as they are. But Several hundred sales, I think over, yeah, I think we got like 700 sales on adult sizes. Yeah, five, oh, never mind. So 579 sales, 500 in the last three days too. So that just shows you people are paying the high for these and they're willing to pay the high for them. They didn't hit the online. They're like, well, oh, well, I'm not waiting for a restock or sneakers. I'm, I'm going for them now. Personally, I'd wait till buying them after the sneakers release. Uh, sneakers release before going for this one but yeah that's pretty much my basic thoughts on these ones do i think it's a hold sure but just kind of want to give you all a small little update uh, on this drop kind of the resale price of it how it's doing uh, and also the update on ama money are canceling a lot of botted orders but you know our orders are still good as of right now on high flaps if you want people running bots for you for the upcoming chicago release future sneaker drops you want to learn how to buy you want daily under market pairs don't forget i do that i have a ton of pairs i need to ship out today so i'm doing that but that's one of our main things we provide along with so many other things Lou Oops, in store info, other things like that. So, I really appreciate you guys. It's everything I really need to say and mention, though. So, yeah, I'm Tristan. Thank you guys. This is uh, I'm, uh, I'm Amani Air Jordan 4 release. I love how this one looks. I will have an in hand review soon, and I'm very excited uh, to do that, uh, you know, pretty close, I guess, down the line, since it shouldn't take more than a week to get here. Hopefully, you know, they'll update tracking sooner or later, but it's the weekend, uh, you know fairly soon so i assume it probably won't update till monday of next week but yeah we'll see i'll be back in charlotte then too which would be nice but that's everything that needs to be mentioned so i thought this comment was funny too if you're ready to sell 102 pair, 100 200 pairs dm me yeah because all the canceled orders what are going to happen with them some will get restocked but some are just gonna go go somewhere who knows so that's it i'm tristan check us out join our wait list ask any questions you have down below and again don't forget Waitlist is free to join. We'll not charge you unless we let you into the group. So that's it. I'm ending the screen recording. I'm Tristan. Thank you guys. And hopefully I will catch you on the next video soon. Peace.